They were my best friends <laughs> growing up. The black kid. <laughs> oh, yeah. I didn't want to leave the hotel. I was scared too. Meanwhile, you think it smelled like straight horse booty, bro. <laughs> <laughs> She's awesome, man. She was cool. I had a really good time with that, bro. Mm. And then we went out to to that Asian buffet, man. Yeah, she she said it was very nice, like, dude. She's that never... was never. Well, that's the thing. Like, it's different from the last time I went there. Oh yeah, yeah, right. Really, it was different from the because the last time I went there was pre twenty twenty. Oh, before pandemic. Before pandemic, and yeah, they they remodeled. They remodeled. Every... Yeah, like it was kind of it's kind of wearing down and stuff. And... and the price is still the same. That's the crazy thing. Yeah, that's true. It's literally still eight. And nine, they added more now. They got yeah. a sushi bar. They have like insane dessert section. Mm -hmm. They added more fruit, uh, ice cream. Uh, dude, I went. I went in on that fruit, bro. Yeah. I got that watermelon, and orange slices, bro. The peaches. They had peaches, bro. Yeah. Oh my god. Fresh I had peaches in a minute. No, really. Is there fruit you haven't had in a while? Blueberries. All of them. <laughs> as you can tell <laughs> no i'm good i'm good but like the vegetables for, 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 for. are healthy ill ah, <laughs> fruit and vegetable ugh. dog so we started <laughs> speaking of vegetable we started that whole ordering uh, uh not pre-made meals but like ordering meals through oh. how do you say it how do you say it like prepare they're not prepared because they're not make... ready to cook they just, we still got to make the food. They just give us the spices. To, right. They to, just give us the ingredients. Yeah. They just ship us the ingredients and a recipe. And then we actually have to make the food. Yeah, Home Chef. Home Chef. Mm -hmm. And this past week. This is not an advertisement for Home Chef. Oh, absolutely We're just, not. Uh, Until you send us a motherfucking sponsor exactly. contract. Yep. You ain't getting no clout off us. This is no. the only time I'm about to mention Exactly. And if our audiences uh, <laughs> get Home Chef, then... Uh, I'm definitely emailing you guys. I'm Absolutely. just saying. Absolutely. I want my cut. I'm just saying. <laughs> I want my cut. 50%. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't Joe Rogan, but I want Get 50%. Out here. Get out of here, Switch. man. What the hell? <laughs> Go ahead, man. What are you saying? So, first week, because we started, what, two weeks ago? Yeah, we started two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. First week. Amazing. Fire. Man. All delicious you know the meals. best part? No heartburn. No heartburn. Mm -hmm. I didn't get no fucking weird intestinal discomfort or mm -hmm. none of that shit because you know like i'm hypersensitive to everything like, yeah no dairy and we're able to take shit no red meat shut the fuck up here we go with that shit thing again oh my god here we go with the shit thing oh uh, shit i'm sick of it <laughs> i'm sick uh, of it man <laughs> oh my god no, nah, because of that doo-doo truck, I can smell oh, shit now. Oh, my goodness, Jeff. All right, we're ending it. I'm for real this time. We're cutting to black. Thank you for watching Tabletop Talk. Oh, man. And then he what clicks the on it and then it comes back and on. And then come back on. Right, just kidding. All right. But, uh, yeah, and then the first week, freaking awesome, bro. We had great meals. But I don't know. Like, I guess they were punishing us. They were like, maybe we sent them too good of a first week of meals. Mm. Because everything this week was broccoli. And I fucking hate broccoli. <laughs> I Whoever, love it. Whoever's idea it was. <laughs> pretty sure it's God. But, you know. <laughs> Cauliflower. Whoever's idea it was to miniaturize trees and decide, yeah, you can eat this. Worst fucking idea ever. I hate broccoli. Best bro. idea ever. I don't know how you love I broccoli. I love broccoli. It tastes like dirt, man. What? It tastes like nah, dirt. Nah, it's delicious. Nah, and then the last meal of that week was cauliflower. I'm just like, that's just white broccoli, bro. That's just Caucasian broccoli. Like, you're not going to fool me. Get the fuck out of here. I don't want that shit. What the uh, fuck? Man. I said that shit to Bruce. Bruce loved me that uh, day, bro. Oh, shit. Every day. Yeah, carrots and uh, cauliflower, yeah. Carrots and cauliflower. But, yeah. man, we, every we, day was broccoli. And I was just like, damn, I'm just going to eat the chicken. That's it, bro. Eat the chicken and then chug a whole bunch of water afterwards. <laughs> but I'm thoroughly excited for this week. We made some, uh, what did we make? Yeah, zucchini and um, it was, was it zucchini? Yep, it was zucchini with uh, chicken and you, you sprinkled some cheese on it. It was zucchini corn. Zucchini corn. Zucchini yeah. corn. Enchilada sauce, um, and chicken, uh, chicken meatball, no pork meatballs. pork meatball, pork meatballs, and I think that was it. It was like three meatballs per person, 
plus the zucchini and the corn. And then yeah, you they overload some... you on the vegetables because they know that's what's going to fill you up. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And no, and it does. It, it really does. did. Because yeah, literally really after does. that, you drink water and then you should be set. Yeah, but it's it like feel. it's like literally that type of food you can go to sleep right after because you're not going to get any heartburn or anything like that. Like. And no indigestion, no indigestion, or anything that, like that, bro. or st- stomach intestinal pain, or anything like that. I love that. So bro. I'm, I'm loving the home chef stuff, man. I really am. Yeah, and of fine. course, again, like, it, like we said, it's saving us a lot on money because with the, the prices of food, food now, going up, food going up, literally, you go to Sands with a hundred dollars and just buy a platter of chicken. But the crazy thing is, because we split, because we split what we order, so. Based off of what we spend every month, it's way cheaper than if we were to go out and buy it, and then it only lasts a week. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? So, it's, and then we get a full course meal. It's portion sized, and we don't have to worry about eating more than our fill. So. You feel that's true. So I really, I really like. That's it. true. That's true. One thing I'll never give up is the sweet. <laughs> I, love I blame that sugar. on mommy. Oh, bro, it's her fault. We got her sugar. Her sugar tooth. Her sugar tooth. Her bro. sweet tooth. Oh, my Yeah, we, we can never stop for some reason. Dog, when it's, like, even when I'm at work, you know, because I'm, like, highly active at work, and I, once I lose energy, how about some guy looked at me and said, won't you eat fruit? I'm like, get the fuck out of my face, man. Give me a Butterfinger, bro. I don't want to eat, eat, have an apple slice or oranges. I'm like, stop nah, playing. bro, that's not real sugar. I want that fake processed shit, bro. <laughs> I want that crash after the rush. I want oh, to feel man. like crap. What? I want to regret my life after eating that. What the heck? <laughs> Apple. Just sandwiches. like the butterfingers you had before you came Dog, here. I don't know what happened. Like, I'm on this butterfinger binge <laughs> this whole week. Like, I'll go to uh, uh, a gas station before work and just grab, like, six butterfingers off the shelf, bro. I don't know what it is, man. I'm just obsessed with Butterfinger. Damn. Until I get tired of it. That's the thing. Like, once my brain locks onto something, uh-huh. like, I can eat it and eat it and do that same thing mm-hmm. and not get tired of it until I just, not, I get tired of it, mm-hmm. I just forget about it. And I'll just be like, remember when I used to binge that thing? I think I've done that before. Yeah. Like, what you've been doing at Albany's? The go. It was Albany's. Bro. After work, I would go to the gas station and buy, like, Hella bags of Albanese. Mm-hmm. And I would just eat that. And then I think the sign where I need to stop eating that one thing is like, I'll get this sharp pain uh, uh, under my tongue. And they'll be like, all right, you got to chill. And then, uh, I see yeah. what you're saying. Like it, because uh, you're eating it too much. Mm-hmm. So the body's like, all right, I'm comfortable. All right, I'm comfortable. I'm it. done. I'm tired of this yeah, shit. Yeah, so now it's time to try something new. Smooth. So you're off the Albanese and now you're, you're on the uh, butterfingers. butterfingers. Ooh, the butterfingers. Mm-hmm. But you know what it is? It was that that programming because we watched that whole discontinued bullshit. Oh yeah. And the thing that kept sticking in my brain. Butterfingers. Butterfingers. It's bro. It's I can easily. Bites. Uh, they were showing the old Simpsons commercial of Butterfingers. Yeah. Right. I could easily be con- uh, conditioned to be a sleeper agent or some shit. Man. Just throw some subliminal bullshit in my brain. I won't even realize you did, and then just say the activate. The, the the activation word the activation word and I'm it's it's over like my brain is just wired to just do that one thing yeah. and until I you know until I get tired of it or until I shut down or whatever disengage disengage sir wait a second is Bruce in here yeah where's he at he's right there under your feet <laughs> wow he's just quiet he's been extra quiet yep. today he's like oh, oh, i'm stuck different. in here for an hour so might as well just uh oh now he's up yeah i think he we said his name too yep. many times now he's tells all right is it time to go <laughs> nah. nah kid go lay down <laughs> go lay 